tell this story, but uh, Ralph Rumphrey, Jeff, and I have a band, we had a band called The Odd Dogs, we, we still do. And um, one day we were rehearsing, and I just started playing this little riff, and, and it always happens, I would play a riff, and Ralph would look at me and go, what is that? And I just looked at him and said, uh, I don't know. And I don't know who came up with the idea, maybe it was Jeff or Ralph, and they said, that's a cool phrase for this classic tune called Footprints. So what we did is probably within a half an hour we came up with this arrangement. So this is a classic tune by Wayne Shorter. Anybody know who Wayne Shorter is out there? Yeah, amazing. Um, and it's not a jazz version. <laughs> and it happens to be in seven. I didn't try to make it in seven. It just came out that way. So this is a tune called Footprints and it's gonna feature everybody. Do you guys know Ralph Humphrey? I think, I know the LACM people do. Yeah. Uh, Ralph Humphrey, oh man, I, I can't say enough about this guy. I can't do it. Where do you start? Yeah, where do you start? Um, you lost the great Los Angeles hero yes. recently. Yes, yes. Um, I don't mean to take the mic, no. but as a drummer, you should do it. Yeah. As a drummer, Ralph, Ralph Humphrey was um, obviously one of the most gifted musicians in the world. He uh, played Don Ellis um, back in the day. He also played with Frank Zappa. Yep. Um, he's on like Overnight Sensation and Apostrophe and all those incredibly great records. Ralph um, was a brilliant musician, but he also was one of the, the greatest teachers and one of the kindest gentlemen I ever knew. And uh, Los Angeles lost one of its heroes uh, recently. Ralph succumbed to cancer uh, six months ago, maybe. More? Last year. Has it been 10 months? It hasn't been a year, but maybe, well, anyway, uh, I actually ended up meeting Ralph in high school. He played, he played at my high school, and he, we were doing a two-day event, and at the time I was in high school, and Ralph got snowed in in Buffalo. So I played the first night of free flight for Ralph when I was like 17. And when I moved to California two years later, Ralph was like a, like the older uncle that I never had. He showed me everything and you know basically welcomed me into this city. So it's interesting that you have this band with Ralph because I have a huge connection to him, as most of us in Los Angeles do. And it's very hard for us to face the fact that we lost our friend and a, and a great musician. But I just figured we should Give a little knowledge of, of Ralph Humphrey. Here's to you, Ralph. Miss you. Thank you so much. Yeah, Ralph was such a part of my life. I knew him when I was a young kid. And I was at MI when the first year they started the, uh, the drum program at MI. I was a student. <laughs> and I got to meet him. And years later, I got to work with him. And it was such an honor to do this band with him. I, I, I wish we could have more records, but we got one record and we got a bunch of videos that we did with Ralph, and I'm really proud of that. Um, so, yeah, so love Ralph, and uh, I'm gonna keep playing his arrangements, keep playing his music. So, again, this one's called Footprints. <laughs> 